Hey everybody, Rick Needham handicapping thoroughbred racing from the nearby Charlestown races in Slots Casino, Charlestown, West Virginia on Thursday night, September the 1st. And this is my dayatthetrack.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race 8 tonight, folks. 10.25 p.m. Eastern Post Time, 7 furlong sprint on the dirt track. Phillies and mares, three years old, an upraise for an allowance purse of some $26,000. Contenders number three, Decola's team. Number six, Prisoner of Hope. Number 10, Allie's the boss. And number 12, Say Whiskey. Number three, Decola's team has produced power and performances in each of her last five outings, hitting the board in four of those adventures, including a power on place finish in her last start, missing, missing a circle trip in that race which was contested at tonight's Trackmaster Plus class level of 69 by just a photograph neck at the wire. Number six, Prisoner of Hope has hit the board in power run fashion in three of her last four races, including a power run win in her fourth race back. Race eight summary, number three, Decola's team tops my contenders list, which also includes number six, <coughs> Prisoner of Hope, number 10, Alley's the boss, and number 12, Save Whiskey, three, six, 10, 12, and the eighth from Charlestown. A couple of <clears throat> bonus long shots for you to think about. River Downs, race six, entry number five, El Polo Volando. Six to one in the morning line, drops in class by six units. It's the overall speed leader in this claiming field, racing at the mild distance on the dirt. Presque Isle Downs, race seven, entry number four, Black Belt, a nine to two shot. Drops in class by 12 units as the speed leader in this wilds field tonight. So from Charlestown on a Thursday night, you're at Needham Ford, day at the track.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.